Good morning, folks. So the news finally broke today that the Beatles are releasing their final single, their final song. It's called Now and Then. Now and Then is a composition that John Lennon had a demo tape of on cassette. And the cassette was given to Paul from Yoko Ono so that he may complete the song like he did with Free as a Bird and, and the other song that appeared on uh, Anthology 1 and 2. So the news broke today that it's being released, but it's being released in conjunction with the Red and Blue albums, which have been completely overhauled. They've been remixed. They're all stereo versions, and they're expanded. There's going to be extra songs on these two albums. Uh, I'll have to dig up further information and pass it along when I hear it. But... Instead of being double albums, as they were on initial release, these albums are going to be three record sets. Or you can buy it as, as the two, two sets, the red and blue album, in one set. So you get a combination of six vinyl records. But this is great news, folks. This is something the world really needs now. Because, you know, the Beatles always preached love and peace, peace and love. Something that Ringo Starr is still doing to this day. So, yes, that is some fantastic news. And as can be expected, there's going to be a cassette single, 45s, but on different colored vinyl. Yes, folks, and I love co colored vinyl. Yes. There's going to be a 12-inch uh, Target exclusive on red vinyl. A 12-inch, well, actually, yeah, 12-inch? 10-inch. I think it's a 10-inch vinyl record of it. Um, and with the flip side being uh, their very first single, Love Me Do. So, this is exciting news, folks. Got an itch. So, this is exciting news. And as you can tell, I'm very excited. I got my Beatles Sgt. Pepper's hat on and really looking forward to this. Uh, is it a cash grab? No, I don't think so. It's a way to release the... The, the Beatles had to live on in legacy, okay? So I guess they're releasing these songs so that people can remember them by. Actually, I was hoping for a Rubber Soul remastered box set, but I don't think that's going to be happening until sometime next year. And then there's also news that broke. A few weeks ago that John Lennon is coming out with uh, uh, a remastered box set. So that's all good in Mind Games. Yep, Mind Games is being released as a, as a John Lennon box set, all remastered. So that's good news. So I also want to give a shout out to my daughter and son-in-law. My daughter gave birth to a, a, a new baby boy. His name's uh, Benjamin Allen. So I, I have a new grandson. Yay. New grandson. You feel so proud. You feel so good about it. Well, more on the Beatles. So these 45s, they're going to be um, colored vinyl, 
standard black vinyl. Then there's a Target exclusive. And who knows how many more companies will will get in on on this and put out their own exclusive uh, 45. Uh, there's going to be a, a double CD set. There's going to be um, the two CD back CD sets in a slip case, so you can get all four CDs at once. That'll be a pretty penny. Or you can get all the six albums, the six vinyl albums, in one slip case. It's going to be on black vinyl and colored vinyl. So the red, red album will will be red vinyl and the blue album will be blue vinyl um i think i'm gonna go for the colored vinyl uh it's quite expensive 80 bucks a pop for the the sets but hey you know i i didn't buy the original sets as colored vinyl but uh these i do want to get as colored vinyl so we shall see I'm gonna might call my uh, record dealer and to see if he can order me the colored vinyl. Uh, as far as a uh, record store day releases, I haven't heard anything. Who knows? Maybe, maybe yes, maybe no. We'll see what comes out. But yeah, big Beatles news. And there's going to be a big marketing campaign, too. They got T-shirts, sweatshirts, uh, a tote bag. So everything's moving along fine with this big campaign. So until next time, all I've got to say is go Beatles.